Hello friends, I am going to tell you how to install OpenCV in Windows 7 in 64-bit operating system and how to configure it in a Visual Studio I am going to tell you in my next video so before that OpenCV is open library so we have to install it and you have to the three steps are mostly important you have to download it then extract in a C extract it in a C drive then you have to set up the environment variables that's a crucial stage of environment stage variable setup so uh, if you are using a different if you wanted to configure it and want to use in a different versions means if you are using visual studio and you also wanted to use in a java or in for python while set up in a environment variable you have to did little changes which i going to mention you after all after the steps so first is to uh, first step is to download the open cv uh, in that link you are get your open cv download so just double click after google search also you can get it so uh, select your version which you want if you are wanted open windows server which version do you want just download it i had already downloaded the previous version so just i'm showing you so you will get a uh, this like application so i had already so i'm going to open cv run it as administrator after that it shows the extraction path so just extract it to the a different location make it as a run then give a different path like C or you can browse it browse it like my computer go to C make it ok so so after that make it to extract I already extracted it so cancel it you will get a folder like that so open CV the build one is important for us so first step is completed second one is also completed the third step and important is the environment variable setup so go to my computer go to computer go to properties then you have to go advanced set setting setup then go to environment variable here make it new after pressing new you have to uh, before that you, know, you have to check it whether you open 32 bits or 64 bit you can check it from this means your properties of your computer it will, it will show you the what time of system you are using a uh, 64 bit operating system i am using if you are using 32 bits which is mean by you are using architecture is uh, x86 if you are using 64 bit your your out architecture is x64 so here we go our step is to uh, set up the variable name so next type your variable name you can give any variable name to your set up your variable name okay after after that give variable value which is the build folder path go to your c means your extracted folder for cv build and click here so you will uh, here you get the path of your OpenCV folder copy it paste it and make it to ok after that the next step is to edit another variable which is a path go uh, you have to edit it so don't edit anything just at the end of its value paste the path of your different variable here if you are using x86 and uh, if I, I am using 
version Visual Studio 12. So for 12, use VC11. For 13, use VC12. So like that, you you will get this path in your OpenCV folder. OpenCV. So if you if you wanted to use for Java, go to Java. Here you get x uh, 64. If you are using 64 bit x86 for you that like plan i am using i am going to use a visual studio means cpp libraries so for that i am going to use x64 in x64 version vc11 so like that so i set up my path uh, open cv x64 version 11 then bin the bin folder is important which shows that you are configure your environment variable correctly so test it properly and then press ok so press then ok and ok so congratulations you install your open cv easily uh, in my next video, I am going to tell you how to configure it Google Studio. So, okay, thanks a lot for watching my video.